currently at $84.65 a share. Yahoo analysts estimate they can move up to $105.57 in the next 12 months. Hey guys, this is the April 1st through April 5th of 2024 edition of this week's winning stocks. Um, and we want to start with the S&P 500, the Dow, and the NASDAQ because we know that those three pretty much represent the entire market. So we want to see which way the market was moving this past week before we look at the stocks on our watch list. So we see that for the S&P 500 or for the SPY, after moving up considerably, a couple of down weeks, but up for the most part, it took a little pause this week. It moved back a little. We should see a similar thing with the Dow, but the Dow moved back even more. As a matter of fact, the Dow retraced where it moved up for like the last two weeks. And for QQQ or NASDAQ, we see it's been sort of moving in a sideways position for a few weeks now. One, two, three, four, five, so about six. This is a down week that just passed. So we see that the S&P 500, the Dow and the NASDAQ have taken a little pause. Now let's look at some of the stocks on our watch list. And we start with Advan 6. Advan 6 is a two star and we know the stocks on my watch list are broken down into three tiers. Three stars is the most fundamentally sound. Two stars is beneath that, not as fundamentally sound, but fundamentally sound. One star is the least fundamentally sound on our watch list. Still fundamentally sound enough to make the watch list, but the least fundamentally sound. Advan 6 is a two star. Currently, they're at $28.45 a share. Yahoo analysts estimate they can move up to $37.33 a share in the next 12 months. Now, they have an earnings report coming out. And it should be on May 3rd or later on in that week. We know an earnings report is sort of like going to a casino. The earnings report can come out, and if it's good, your stock can jump up dramatically. The stock price can jump dramatically. If it's a bad earnings report, the stock price can drop dramatically. The problem with an earnings report is you don't know whether it's going to be good or bad beforehand. As a matter of fact, if you do know and you trade on that information, that's actually called insider trading. And it can land you in jail. So you don't know which way that stock is going to go beforehand. In any event, we're in the beginning of April. They have an earnings report coming in the beginning of May, May 3rd or later that week. Darling Ingredients. 
They are a two star. Currently at $44.64 a share. Yahoo analysts estimate they'll move up to $64.47 a share in the next 12 months. They have moved up one, two, three, four, five, six. We have six green arrows here. We see they took a pause this week, moved down a little this week. We want to see what they do going into the next week. They have earnings report dropping on May 7th or later on that week. CVX, Chevron Corporation. They're currently at $161.60 a share. Yahoo analysts estimate they can move up to $177.03 in the next 12 months. They're a one star, and they have an earnings report coming out on April 26th. Archer Daniels Midland. They are a one star. Currently at $63.46 a share. Yahoo analysts estimate them moving up to $64.08 a share in the next 12 months. Now, they dropped a bit, if you could see here on the chart. And they actually moved up for a few weeks, but mostly these two here. They have an earnings report coming out on April 23rd. Devon Energy. Oh, forgot to mention with Archer Daniels Midland, they are going to be removed from the watch list after this week. So you won't see them again unless they drop to the 52 week low again. Devon Energy, another company that will be removed. They are a one star. Currently at $53.27 a share. Yahoo analysts estimate they can move up to $54.35, which they're almost at. They have an earnings report dropping on May 1st. And you see that they moved up quite a few weeks. One, two, three... Six, seven, eight, looks like around 10 weeks here. Humana. They haven't started to move up yet. But they came to our gaze when they dropped one, two, three weeks significantly. They started to move up, even mentioned them in this week's option picks. Then, after that week, they started to drop again. The dropping continued. You see a positive week here, another one here, then another slightly negative week. And now they've dropped significantly again. We want to see if going into this next week, they continue to drop, they start to move sideways, or they finally start moving up. We know that the healthcare companies are experiencing some problems right now, of which Humana is among them. So we'll take a look and see what happens. 
Mosaic Company. They are a two star. Currently at $32.95 a share. Yahoo analysts estimate they can move up to $37.56 in the next 12 months. They're moving in a sideways pattern. And they have an earnings report coming out on May 1st or that week of. Air Products and Chemicals. They're currently at $238.68 a share. Yahoo analysts estimate they can move up to $264.95 in the next 12 months. Now, this company took a significant drop and after they took that drop they started to move up we actually um, had some good fortune from here I'll show you um, later or soon to come but then after that they moved down a little and they're sort of moving sideways we want to see what they do going forward. Do they continue moving sideways, start to go down, or start to move up? Now, we put out, or I put out, a this week's option picks. You see that this is this week's stock winners, but I also put out a this week's option picks. It's actually this month's option pick in YouTube, but the this week's option pick still exists. And in this week's option picks, when it was still on YouTube, we chose, or I chose, air products and chemicals. Um for the this week's option pick and when I pick it I pick it I buy it and I immediately put out a video letting you know I bought it so that if you want to buy it you can benefit as well well I bought it on March 19th I bought it on I'm sorry I bought it on February 9th I sold it on March 19th. That's a month and 10 days. In that time, I made a $1,398.66 return. That's a return of 105.90% 105 in a month and 10 days. Since that time, this week's option picks has now moved into my Patreon channel. And those things that are in the Patreon channel are only for subscribers of the Patreon channel. But now that this is just about sold... I could let you know about it in the Patreon channel. I let the people on the Patreon channel know that I bought Archer Daniels Midland. Archer Daniels Midland was bought on March 12th. And now we're up to April 6th. So almost a month ago and two options were bought those two options were bought for $839.32 I now have a return of $1,398.66 
$679.14. That's a 80.91% return in a little less than a month. Now, if you want to join the Patreon channel, if you go to my homepage for YouTube, you'll see the link for Patreon. Going into this week's option picks, it's just $25 a month. And you, when you sign up, you would send an email to Uncle Dwayne's watchlist at gmail.com. Include your name and phone number in that email. Doesn't matter what country. And when you do that, I will add you to the WhatsApp group as well. The people in the WhatsApp group, for those not in the WhatsApp group, you only see videos that I may put out at night when I have the opportunity to make these videos. Those in the WhatsApp group, you can be updated on things any time of the day. No matter where I am, no matter what time it is in the day, I could pop a quick text letting you know okay, I'm buying this or I'm looking at this or whatever the case is, option price is this or whatever. So if you join the Patreon, just $25 a month, you want to send me, email me that name and phone number so I can add you to the WhatsApp as well. In any event, continuing with our list, in this week's stock winners, we have Haymanetics Corporation. They are a two star, currently at $84.65 a share. Yahoo analysts estimate they can move up to $105.57 in the next 12 months. They have an earnings report coming out on May 9th or the week of. And you see they were down here, moved up a little sideways, up a little. Want to see if they continue to move up, move sideways or go back down again. Paycom, they're about to be removed from the list after this. Paycom actually was at their 52-week low. Then they came back down. They're moving up now. They're currently at $198.29 a share. Yahoo analysts believe they can move up to $203.08 a share in the next 12 months. And they are a three star. We see them going sort of sideways, but they're about to be removed from the watch list as well. Malibu Boats. They're a three star. Currently at $43.01 a share. Yahoo analysts estimate they can move up to $48.29 a share in the next 12 months. Notice they have an earnings report coming out on May 1st. And they moved up a couple of weeks. They were slightly down this last week. We want to see what they do moving forward. Conmed Corporation, they're a one star, currently at $77.90 a share. Yahoo analysts estimate 
they can move up to $110.57 a share. They have an earnings report coming out April 24th, towards the end of this month. And notice from the bottom they had a positive week, another slightly negative week. We want to see what they do going into this week, whether it's further down, sideways, or up. Starbucks Corporation. Any who love coffee should be familiar with Starbucks. Well, Starbucks is actually a no star. Under normal circumstances, Starbucks would not even be on my list, but because of the popularity of the company, I put it here this time. They're currently at $86.85 a share. Yahoo analysts estimate they can move up to $106.45 a share in the next 12 months. They have an earnings report coming out on April 30th or the week of. And notice they, well, I would say they were moving sideways here. They dropped a little. Then this last week, they took another drop, pretty sizable compared to some of their other candles. In any event, I will be dropping the analysis, the stock analysis on Starbucks this weekend. So you could look at the stock analysis and see what I have to say about them if this is something that you're considering. Simply Good Foods. They are a two-star, currently at $32.20 a share. Yahoo analysts estimate they can move up to $42.64 in the next 12 months. Now, this last week was a negative week, but the interesting thing is, even though this candle went all the way down here, it moved back up halfway towards the end of the week. So we want to see going into this next week, if it goes sideways, continues to go down, or starts to move up. So that's it for our watch list this week guys i look forward to speaking to you in the next video have a great night